Let's take a look at organizational culture. Organizational culture should be how the firm achieves its mission by living its values and belief on a daily basis, and management needs to be specific about the values and behaviors it expects from its people. Organizational culture consists of the shared values and assumptions of how its members will behave. It's not easy to build a culture that's open and excited about change, rather than resistant to it. But the culture should instill ethical standards and cultivate people who care about each other and about their work. In this course, we'll describe how people learn the organization's culture and the importance of having a strong, positive culture. When hiring, an important consideration is matching the person to the culture. Newcomers need to learn and be integrated into the organization's culture. Culture is learned through observing and interacting with employees, events, and training. Here are five ways that employees learn the organizational culture. Heroes who make outstanding contributions to their organizations. Stories often about those founders and others who have made extraordinary efforts. Slogans that capture the culture. Symbols such as logos, plaques, pins, or jackets that, again, capture the culture. Ceremonies that capture values. The two dimensions of an organization's culture are strong and weak and positive and negative. Organizational cultural strength is characterized by a continuum from strong to weak. Organizations with clear values that are shared to the extent of similar behavior have strong cultures. In strong cultures, norms are used to enforce desired behaviors. Organizations that have no stated values and do not enforce behavior have weak cultures. So the more alike the values and behavior, the stronger the culture and vice versa. An organizational culture is considered positive or healthy when it has norms that contribute to effective performance and productivity. A negative or unhealthy organizational culture is a source of resistance and turmoil that hinders effective performance. The most effective organizational culture that leads to effective performance is strong and positive. 